Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you with a seven box all star baseball mixer number one from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Uh, at the end of the break, we'll do a separate randomizer, separate dice roll, separate everything. We're giving away one Steiner box at the end of this break, a Steiner Jaspies memorabilia box, which should be pretty awesome if you've seen our previous videos of this. But this mixer should be pretty good too. Uh, P.S. No veteran base ships, no paper base ships, but all everything else does. Chrome, rookie cards, inserts, refractors, numbered cards, and obviously the hits, the autographs and the relics will all ship. Okay, we got to do a randomizer first. So let's get that set up. Let's get some dice. Let's get two lists right here. And a big thank you to all of these folks right here. Karen, all the way down to David for getting into this action. Really appreciate it. All teams are in. And let's roll the dice and randomize each list 10 times. Six and a four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10th and final time. Got J-Mac on the pole, Adam K in the number 30 spot. Paste the names here. Six and a four, 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Astros on top, Angels are on the bottom. All right, and here we go. So, J Mac, you have the Houston Astros. Jason K with the Giants, Jeremy 33 with the A's, Smitty, you got the Reds, Dave Marin, Last Pod Mojo, Nationals. Jay Kreider with the White Sox, Aaron with the Cardinals, John C with the Rays, Jeremy 33, Mets, and Mariners. Donald with the Rockies, John C. with the Pirates, Richard Sewell with the Indians, Eric with the Red Sox, Aaron with the Phillies, J. Mack with the Twins, Mike Cody with the Diamondbacks, Karen with the Royals, Michael Earl with the Dodgers, Adam McKay got the Cubbies, TJ with the Marlins, Jay Kreider with the Tigers, Will, Bulldog fan with the Yankees, I've heard of those guys, Michael Van Wy with the Brewers, Patrick Edwards with the Blue Jays, Jacob Hill, Padres and Orioles, Dave Marin with the Braves, Karen Steele with the Rangers, and Adam McKay with the Anaheim Angels. So there you go, folks. I'm going to alphabetize these by team. Let's get this typed in right here. Saturday, 7, 8, 17. Jaspies, 7 box. All-Star. Uh... MLB baseball mixer RT number one plus Steiner. All right, <laughs> Eric's like it's the third time I've been randomized the Red Sox, but hey, he's not complaining. All right, no thanks, says Jeremy thirty three. Looks like we just may, may just have to go. Come on, man. Is this printer not plugged in? That should be good. There you go. Do your thing, printer. We just moved our computers around, so and I can't pause the video, so we have to deal with this situation here. No? Aha! There we go. I hear something. There we go. All right. Officially printed out. Trade window closed.
And good luck, everybody. There we go. That's the official printout right there. And here are the seven boxes right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Six and seven right here. Okay, well, let's start with, let's go back in time first. Let's start in 2015. Go with these. One autograph per box. We'll pop all these open, go from there. Uh, the Asia release, um, they just, the Asia exclusive means they just, uh, they only release this to the Asian market. And then after, after some amount of time, then they'll release it to our market after that. But I think they just add, there, there may be like different inserts that are added, but essentially the checklist is pretty much, uh, is pretty much the same. There's really no difference. Why, why not? It's a, it's a global sport, Arcade. Why do we collect soccer cards? All right. Here we go. We're going to start off with Maris Ramirez, Trey Ball, We got Drew Ward. I believe those inserts are a little bit different. Hunter Henry. There's Rysel Iglesias. Mini Braden Shipley. These are pretty cool. Nick Gordon. I forget which ones were numbered, which ones weren't. James Needy. Justin Nicolino, Tim Anderson, he's playing now, Carlos Correa, I've heard of him, I believe this might be one of the Asia exclusive parallels, I don't remember, David Dahl, Eddie Butler and Jose Peraza, who's now in the Reds, that will still go to the Braves. There's Jose Barrios, 24 out of 50. Nice gold paper. That's for the Twins. That'll go to J-Mac. It's a pretty nice one, J-Mac. Kevin Ploiecki. Dariel Alvarez. Luis Severino. And Hunter Renfro. It's kind of cool to see this 2015 set there's Henry Owens, uh, because you start to see, um, you start to notice a lot of the players that are now that have now been called up. One thirteen out of four ninety nine gray paper, Kevin Ploiecki. There's Kyle Schwarber. Refractor. Got red paper right there. Uh, TJ, you have the Marlins. And this is our first box. 
Nice Manuel Margot. He used to be a big prospect for the Red Sox, now with the Padres. Robbie Ray, who's been pitching pretty well. Got Aranola Mini. Haven't seen our autograph yet. Forrest Wall, Zach Granke, Ice. Ando Arcia, Adam Engel. Where's our autograph? Greg Bird. And there it is, Trevor May. Nice autograph for the Twins and J-Mac. Nice. Let me see if I could get a better focus on this. I feel like the camera is, is off a little bit. No, it's, it's all right. All right, there you go, J-Mac. That was your autograph. Let me go through the rest of the cards, see if there's any other parallels, folks. Trevor May, an up-and-coming prospect. There's Tuki Toussaint as well, 62 out of 99 for the Diamondbacks. That'll be for Mike Cody. So you got two of their big pitching prospects. Jose Barrios and May. And there we go. That was 2015. Bone Baseball, Asia edition. Slide this over here. All right, uh, let's go from 15 to 16. Uh, the autograph was Trevor May. So we got two autographs per box on this one. So this is Topps Chrome Baseball 2016. Good luck, everybody. Let's turn on a fan here. It gets a little warm. It's a little warm under those studio lights. All right. Next one. Good luck, everybody. Wait, is this 2000? Oh, this is 2016. We'll do that one next. Just want to stay, stay within the same years. So it feels consistent. So we just did a box of 2015. Now we're in the world of 2016. Good luck, everyone. All right, David Price, Yuris Familia, 
Chris Bryant Future Stars. It's Mike Trout. It's a nice shot right there. Byron Buxton. There he is again. Mark Teixeira. Kyle Schorber Refractor. And there's one of our autographs already. That's Socrates Brito. For the Diamondbacks. That'll go to Mike Cody. It's a rookie auto. Hopefully he'll open up some sort of food truck with Taco Charlton. That would be a dream come true for me. It'd be pretty great. I'm going to keep adjusting this white balance here a little bit. Let's warm up the color a little bit. There we go. It's nice. All right, that was auto number one of two. Jose Bautista. Nice, Steve Aoki, the first pitch. Dodgers team, I'll go to the Dodgers. Nice Altuve, Prism. David Wright, Craig Kimbrell. Should have one more auto in here somewhere. And there it is. Put a bird on it. Greg Bird. 242 out of 499. Nice bird for Bulldog fan and the Yankees. Uh, Kenta Maeda is doing okay. Jeremy 33. Put together, a, a, still doesn't go as deep into games as I think as he would like as well. Put in, put together a nice five inning start the other night though, which was solid. But hasn't been as sharp as he was last year, for some reason. So now we're in the world of 2000. Well, no, you know what? Let's stay in the world of 2016. Sorry, we'll hold on to this 2017 in a second. Let's do 2016. Let's stay in that world for a little bit longer. Just a little bit longer. Uh, I think he's in his late. He's got to be in his late 20s. Julio Urias. We we're not going to see him until next year. I think his recovery and surgery is like 12 to 14 months. Henry Owens. Nomar Mazzara. Trevor Story. Nice Stephen Piscotti. Right here for the Cardinals. That'll go to Aaron. And your autograph is Juan Gon Gonzalez. 5 out of 20. Nice. There's another nice parallel right here too. Rangers. Karen Steele. Nice. And this other one right here goes to Mike Cody and the Diamondbacks. 58 out of 60 on that one, Mike. A.J. Pollock. And then you got a Lidor and Jose Canseco. All right. Now we move into, now we move into 2017. One autograph per box on this one. Not sure what the Dodgers need to do. I'm a big Dodgers fan. Not sure what the Dodgers need to do by that trading deadline. Um, I guess it's 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 hard to really nitpick a team that has like one of the best records in baseball, if not like first or second best record in baseball. So it's hard to really nitpick too much. I guess I personally would like a right-handed starter, a front of the rotation starter. Dodgers are very lefty-heavy in their starting rotation. 
So they could use a sort of front line, front of the line, two or three, number two or number three starter. Right-hander would be nice to sit behind Kershaw. Could all, any, any team could, any playoff team could use bullpen help. I could always shore up the bullpen, even though the Dodgers bullpen has been doing well. That's what I'd like to see. But we'll see. I think the Dodgers will be active, though. I think they'll definitely be active in the uh, trainer. Yeah? You want to send a Sonny Gray, Smitty? I'll take Sonny Gray. Smitty's an A's guy. Uh, for who? Let's make a deal right now. Then we'll send, we'll, send it, we'll send it to our respective front offices. It's like, don't worry. Me and Smitty, we got it figured out. We, we, we hammered it out for you guys. Prospect, how, how many prospects? Which ones? That's the big issue. All right. Start with Odubel Herrera. And we got a purple Matt Chapman. 98 out of 250 for the A's. That'll go to Jeremy 33 with that parallel. Cody Reed. Lindor. I love these old school cards right here. There's Mike Piazza. Jake Bowers. And blue paper. 145 out of 150. Angel Perdomo. Dodgers could get Darvish as well. I mean, but, but see, it's just it's all a matter of who the Dodgers want to who the Dodgers want to move prospect wise. You know, obviously, you Darvish is going to require a lot more prospects. You know, maybe some of these guys, not Cody Bellinger, but you know, Willie Calhoun might be interesting. He's got he's got a good bat. But his uh, apparently his glove is something that's left to be desired, so that's kind of an issue. So maybe Willie Calhoun in an AL organization they could still use a bat like his in the lineup. That could be something interesting for like a Sonny Gray maybe, plus others. But that could be a, a one of the starting points. I mean, Dodgers aren't going to trade guys like Walker Bueller. That's just not going to happen. So we'll see how it all we'll, just, we'll see how it all shakes out. Ooh, nice orange parallel. Yes, three out of twenty-five Red Sox edition of Yoan Mankata. That goes to Eric Coyle. That's pretty cool. In that old school look as well. Nice Aaron Judge. We'll set these aside too, even though it's just a regular card. People are going nuts over Aaron Judge. Like Bulldog fan, I wouldn't be surprised if that sells for like 10 bucks. You know what I mean? <laughs> Which is like a third of the spot of the cost of admission. There's a buyback card. Chad Hermanson, Pirates. That will go to John C. I think these, uh, the different colors on the stamps will tell you how short printed they are. And there's our autograph, Luis Carpio. No number on there, Jeremy thirty three. Who got who? You got your Mets in the randomizer, but there's your autograph. That's yours. Is there another orange right there? Love these oranges. Yes, Andrew Sopko for the Dodgers. 19 out of 25. Little Dodger Joe Mojo for Michael Earl.
And another buyback, Mark Newfield, with that old school Mariners hat right there. That's pretty cool. And the rest. All right, nice. Let me sleeve all these up. Osako oh, is? T TJ saying he's in the back end of the uh, Tulsa Drillers rotation. How's he doing? Yeah, Dodgers sort of have an embarrassment of riches in their in their uh, farm system. So not all of them are going to be able to go up to the big leagues, right? Not all of them are going to make it. They're going to have to, and some of them are that we trade away. The Dodgers are going to have to make some hard decisions. Just quickly top load all of these guys, and then we'll move on to the Diamond Kings box. And then the last two Odyssey boxes, and then we're going to see who gets a Steiner box. This is a Steiner giveaway. One Steiner box being given away. Lots of awesome memorabilia there. We've got another one of these mixers on jazpiecehobbyland.com, which includes a box of 2015 Bowman Baseball, which has prospect autos of Aaron Judge. So hurry up and uh, go get it. It's a good price point, too. Just $29.99. For a spot or for a random team spot on jazbeeshobbyland.com, check out the seven box mixer, jazbeeshobbyland.com, because that's where the big hits can be. Good, I, I saw that, Mojo. I saw it the first time. Thank you. We'll get to all of those orders after I'm finished with this break. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Now we're in 2017 with that Bowman box and now the Diamond Kings box. We should see a relic and an autograph out of here. Diamond Kings, pretty solid. I'm a fan of it. I like the sort of matte finish that they have on there. There's Nap. Got some cool gray frames. Some of those frames are numbered depending on what color the frame is. There's Yachty, Yachty or Molina, dual relic. Nice, not numbered, but still going to the Cardinals, of course. Aaron with the Cardinals. The dirt bike racer. That's why I do that, because sometimes the cards get stuck on the back. Gabby Hartnett. Just this focus here a little bit. We've got Bat Kings. Mike Napoli. 52 out of 99. Piece of Napoli's bat and his autograph. Nice one for the Indians. Richard Sewell with that one. There you go, Richard. All right, now let's see what else we have. We've got a Mike Trout variation. Matt Carpenter red frame. That's 18 out of 99. Uh, keeper. It specifically says in the item description that we do not send base. No veteran base card ship, no paper base ship, but everything else does. All that information we always have in our item description, whether we do or do not. If it doesn't say anything, then everything ships. Roberto Clemente. Tommy Heinrich, 42 out of 99, artist proof. 
Relic for the Yankees. Hack Wilson. Usually in larger mixers like this or any product with a lot of with a lot of excessive base cards, they'll they'll uh, they'll not veteran base generally will not ship stuff like tier one. Yeah, obviously everything ships in tier one. Higher end sets like that, any any set that's pretty much like a one pack per box kind of break. And I think everything's numbered, right? Or maybe they're only hits. So there you go. So that makes it easy. All right. Clear this stuff away. Let's make some room for that Odyssey. All right. Good luck, everyone. Um, I guess college rules will apply. If anybody's in their college uniform, or if it's like a cut auto, if it's a cut auto, then it'll be it'll go to the team that um, that the person played for the longest, right? So if it's a cut auto, it doesn't have any team association to it. If like the it, they're usually graded, so if it doesn't have like a team associated with it, then we'll use kind of what team they played for the longest kind of rule that we often use. All right, good luck. Like this. Uh, I don't think anyone saw it. Um, Six-time All-Star. Any guesses? There's like a little trivia card right here. We could be game show right here. Six-time All-Star. 92. Oh, hold on. Let me see. I don't want to give it away too early. Owns the record for most appearances with 1,071. Oh, did you see? 100 complete games and 200 saves. That's the only player to do that. No hitter. May 30th, 1977. I think TJ's got it. Two-time leader in saves, number four all-time. He was a 75 AL Rookie Pitcher of the Year, 1992 NL AL Cy Young, 92 AL MVP, and 88 AL CS MVP. Six-time All-Star, Dennis Eckersley. The Eck. So I'm glad I explained that this way. Because now, this will go to the team he played for the longest. So according to baseballreference.com, Dennis Eckersley, who did he play for the longest? By one season, played for the A's. Nine seasons with the A's, eight seasons with the Red Sox. So this will go to the Oakland Athletics. That'll go to Jeremy 33. Yeah, I wasn't sure if it was if it was the A's or the Red Sox. Do I have post-it notes here? Yes. So the A's with that one. And the next one here. Where's the car? Oh, there it is. Okay, here we go. All right. Hall of Fame 1984. 10-time All-Star, two-time World Series champion, was born in 1918, died in 1999. And his number one was retired. His number one was retired by this team. TJ saying Boog Powell. Johnny Bench says Smitty. Arcade thinking Mickey Mantle or Jim Thorpe. It is Harold Henry Pee Wee Reese. There's his autograph. There's the PSA DNA. His number one was retired by the Dodgers. And there you go, folks. That would be for Michael Earl. All right, time to see who gets the Steiner box.
So let's go back to go back to this page right here. Mike Cody down to Dave Marin. Let's get your names in here. We're gonna randomize the boxes first. There were 21 boxes when we first originally made this print run from Steiner. And we're gonna use one dice roll for both lists, but we're gonna do the boxes first. So we're gonna see which box we get first. I'll pull out the box, I'll bring it here so you can get all hyped up. Then we'll see who gets that box. All right, rolling the dice. for Then this will be for both lists, but the boxes first. Six times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Box 19. Now, if that box is not available, we'll just go to the next box down, to, to box 10. I think we have 19, though. Box 19. Ooh, here we go. Box 19 is available. There it is. And let's see who gets box 19. So once again, six times for the names. Name on top wins it. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final. I said six, right? Yeah, two and a four. There's five times. Here's the sixth and final time. Good luck, everybody. And it's Adam Kupperman. <laughs> Adam K. I think he's won like three of these now. Uh, Adam K., congrats. Thanks for getting in. Thanks for buying your spots. You can't win if you don't play. He played. He won. Box 19 for you. Good luck. There's box 19. There's the Steiner sticker right there. Feels a little light for a helmet. I, I guess it could be a helmet. It is, no, it's a basketball. It's a Spalding basketball. Do we have an authenticity card? It is up here. Wow. That's pretty cool. It's the pony autograph. On a nice full-size basketball, it's the pony. Kristaps Porzingis. There's the authenticity right there. That is awesome. Just don't accidentally play with this one, Adam K. There it is, folks. That's Jasmine Seven Box All Star Baseball Mixer with a one box Steiner giveaway right here. We could get stuff like that. That's pretty awesome. We've got another mixer, the same exact configuration, same exact giveaway in the store right now. Jaspie's Hobbyland.com. This is Joe. Check it out. Let's do another one. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.